The resignation of Savannah Butler, the Opelousas police officer accused of shooting police chief Greg LeBlanc and his wife Crystal, was the topic of discussion at the city council meeting. News 10's Jasmine Dean gives us a look at the council's decision on if Butler will be allowed to resign or if she'll be fired. The Opelousas Board of Aldermen voted to accept the resignation of Opelousas Police Officer Savannah Butler at tonight's council meeting. Members of the Opelousas Board of Aldermen accepted the resignation of Opelousas Police Officer Savannah Butler and decided to postpone approving payment for unused annual leave in compensatory time. I accept the resignation and, uh, until the so the committee can look at the, uh, the documentation that is being presented by the Opelousas Police Department. Prior to resigning, Butler was placed on paid administrative leave due to her involvement in the December shooting of the Opelousas Police Chief Greg LeBlanc and his wife Crystal LeBlanc. Butler submitted her resignation to the Opelousas Police Department on February 16th. I moved that we table this for further discussion because the time sheet was in question. As the decision was made, Mayor Alcindor reminded members about the time limit on how long they have to approve or deny a payment to Butler. At the end, at the end of any officer's working time, no longer employed, according to Fire and Police Civil Services, Mr. Musa can operate. We have a time limit before that amount of money is supposed to be paid. Yeah. In Opelousas, Jasmine Dean, KLFY News 10.